Hello and welcome to another stream, this time of Sail Away, the sailing simulator. Uh, the game is in early access. Um, I have to admit I am in no way, shape or form uh, a sailor. I have never sailed in my life and I would not be surprised if we... Um, crash the boat at the first instance and sing and die sink and die a horrible death but this is a sailing simulator so nothing can happen to us that's what I keep telling myself a slight change this time around for the stream uh, it is a very spontaneous stream but I decided I was going to mix things up a little bit we have a webcam a face cam hello hi nice to uh, uh, see you uh, thanks for joining me, and uh, just to make it very clear, I'm not a sailor. Definitely not a sailor. But um, with that, uh, the uh, game when you start it up, uh, as, as I say, it is an, an early access, so the full version might be it might be slightly different. But when you start the game up, you uh, come pretty much straight into a tutorial, which looks like this. And right, so we've got map and GPS. Uh, welcome to Sailaway. Thank you for taking this brief introduction tour. Click next to check out what you can do with Sailaway. Let's see. Okay, we'll see if we can steer. Steering is good. You can steer and operate the boat like you would do with a real sailboat. Okay, that doesn't really help me much. To steer, click the helm with the mouse. Hold the mouse button down and drag it left or right. You can. Okay, 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 okay. Right. I have no idea what I'm doing. Hello. Are we freezing? No. Right. Um, hold the mouse button down and drag it left to right. You can also use A and D. Okay, A and D seems to be better. Uh, look around. You can look around by clicking somewhere on an empty space on the screen and just dragging the mouse left to right while you hold the mouse button down. Okay, so maybe that's what we were doing. Okay, we were looking around. We weren't actually steering. Fair enough. I can, I, I can deal with that. Uh, let's see. Move around. To move to a different position on the boat, you can either click the blue circle that, uh, that lights up when you move your mouse, press the page up, the page down key, or use the button in the bottom of the right corner of the screen. Okay, okay, I can see, yeah, yeah, it works. Adjust the lines. Uh, to adjust the sails, you can click a rope called a line on a boat, and then pull or ease it with the mouse. But in this tutorial, your skill level is set to beginner, and all you can do is steer. Well, thank God for that. Not sure we would get anywhere if we uh, actually had to do stuff. Skill levels. If you want to change the skill level, you can do it through the main menu, top right button or escape key, and select options, gameplay. Yes, we will probably do that later on, but for now, we are a beginner. Activities. Also in the main menu, right top button, you can find other tutorials, accept a challenge, join a race, or... Accept an invitation from someone to sail together. Uh, I can't actually see the message, so I have no idea what it says. Something about one of the that hangs the cabin. Okay. It's probably a very important message. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Don't forget to check out the other tutorial under main menu activities tutorials. Okay. Do you want to start the next tutorial steering about? Oh, yes, please. Definitely. Becoming a helmsman. As a helmsman, you need to know a few basic things before you start turning that wheel or pull that helm. Lucky for you, this is a f this is fairly easy to learn. Well, indeed, lucky for me then. Momentum. When you turn the steering wheel, the boat does not respond immediately. This is because a boat is big and heavy. It responds with a delay. Try it if you want. Okay. Hold on. I want to look around somewhere. No, I want to look around. Okay, 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 okay. Hold on. Whoa, where, where, where are we? Where are we? Hello? Okay, I'm starting to get the hang of this. Move to this position. No, I don't want to move to that position. I want to go back. Um, okay, let's see. We're, we're going straight. We're going straight. One moment, please. Hang on while the boat turns against the wind. Why are we turning against the wind? What happened? I'm guessing this is part of the tutorial. Where do I want to go? I want to go... I feel like I'm going to fall off the boat. 
against the wind. You can't sail straight against the wind. The sails flapping back and forth, the boat lies dead in the water. The rudder hardly works because you have no speed. This is called in irons. Okay, I appear to be in irons right now then. When the boat has no speed, there's no pressure on the rudder and the boat will steer very slowly. You need to uh, you need forward speed to be able to steer properly. I feel like the boat's about to tip over. Okay, but we are moving, we are moving. True wind angle, you can recognize when the boat is in irons, the front bow is pointing towards the wind, the angle to the wind is around zero degrees. This angle is called true wind angle, or shortened TWA. See if you can find the value for TWA. Uh, I don't think I quite follow. Uh, when the boat's around zero degrees. Okay, so hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So we're at five, five, six, six, seven, eight, nine. Does that mean I am now at... This is zero TWA? Zero degrees TWA? Have I found it? I have no idea if I found it. Upwind. Upwind one. Try to steer the boat to the right starboard, away from the wind until the TWA is about 45 degrees. I think we can just about manage that. Hello. No, no. This is, this is more than 45 degrees, boat. More than 45 degrees. Yep, this is less than 45 degrees now. Definitely less than 45 degrees. 20... Okay, a little bit more. 26. A little bit more. It's like fine-tuning. 40, 45. Oh, there... Ah, oh, man. We were so close. There we go. There we go. On it. No, 47. Oh, wait, wait, we are TWA 45 degrees. Does that, does that mean we're doing it? I have no idea. I think we've done it. Oh, crew. Ah, okay, so does that mean, ah, I guess that means that we can have a crew at some point. No, I've absolutely no idea where I'm going. Where is the map? Map. Okay, I'm, uh, oh, there's, oh, Kinshasa. Maybe we should sail around the Cape of uh, South Africa and uh, head towards East Africa to Kenya. That might be interesting. Let's see if we can do it. I think it'll take ages. No, I have no idea. So I'll um, try to steer the boat to the right. Okay, let me steer to the right again. Maybe I need... Ah, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I get it. So I need TWA on this angle. There we go. We've done it. Upwind 2. You're now sailing upwind. Most boats will start moving forward at a TWA of about 40 to 45 degrees. Now try to steer the boat further away from the wind until the TWA is somewhere between 90 and 150 degrees. Okay, okay. Hold on. No, not too much. There we go. Reaching. You're now sailing on a reach. The wind is coming from your side. This is when the boat will sail fastest. Click next to watch how the boat steers further until the TWA is almost 180 degrees. Okay. Ah, so it's auto steering. Just looking at that. Let me close that again so we have a little bit more view of the um, boat itself. One moment, please. Watch how the boat steers further to the right until the TWA is almost 180 degrees. Downwind. You're now sailing downwind. Um, okay. Uh, the wind is coming from behind you. Funny enough, this is when most boats sail the slowest. 
click next to find out what happens when we steer the boat just a little bit further. Okay, so we are... Bam! This was called a gibe. Jibe? Gibe? Jibe? If anybody knows, uh, pop it into the chat. Um, as always, we are live on uh, Twitch, Mixer, and uh, YouTube Live as well. And using uh, Restream's little uh, chat application, we're able to merge all of the uh, incoming chats into one, which makes it a little bit easier for me to keep track of anything that's going on. Um, Obviously, it does get a bit confusing if somebody from Twitch writes something and uh, the people in YouTube don't see it, but um, we'll, get, we'll, we'll, we'll get used to that. So, gibing or jibing, bam, this was called a jibe. We steered a little bit too far downwind and suddenly the sail flipped over to the other side. This is when serious accidents can happen on a boat. If the wind is strong enough, you may even break the mast. Okay, we don't want to do that. When you're on a sailboat, always watch out for a dive. If you and if uh, you're behind the wheel, keep a good eye on the wind angle and never let it go beyond 180 degrees. Better keep it a little margin. Click next to see how we complete the circle. Okay. One moment, please. Watch how the boat keeps steering to the right to complete a full circle. Um, just going to see if I can maybe move into a different position. So let's move back here. Yeah, perfect. Now we have a bit of view of the boat lovely and we can see where we're going and we can see a nice sail as well much better okay reaching back on a reaching course the wind blows sideways one moment please watch how the boat steers further to the right until it sails upwind again so let's just see actually where we're going oh, okay so we're now heading back towards north africa interesting what's our gps trim Okay, so that must be the uh, sail then. Okay, upwind. The boat is sailing upwind uh, again now. Try to steer further against the wind and keep on turning until you sail upwind. 45 degrees with the sails on the other side. Push the helm away from you. Um, so, does that mean this way? I think so. 45 degrees, a little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. No, no, that's a little bit less. Uh, the boat is sailing upwind. Stay to the right. Yes, that's what I've done. Okay. Tacking. Can I just move this over here? No. Okay. Ah, but I can I move this? Yes. Ah, okay. I can move this. Lovely. Let's move this over here so you guys can uh, also see it, and it's not hidden by the uh, by the webcam. And I. Oh, perfect, I can move this as well. That makes it a little bit easier for me. Okay, perfect. Tacking, congratulations, you just made your first tack. Tacking is when you steer up against the wind until the wind becomes from the other side of the boat. Tacking is the opposite of gibing. Driving. Okay. Against the wind. This is how boats can sail against the wind. They sail upwind for a while, then tack and sail upwind some more. Okay. Sounds easy enough. So maybe by the end of the stream, I may have to change the uh, face cam text from not a sailor to almost a sailor. Well done. You now know the most important things about steering a boat. The courses upwind, reaching downwind, the maneuvering, driving, and tacking. Do you want to start the tutorial sail types? Yes, why not? So at the moment we are... You need to sail the Sailway Cruiser 38 for this. Sorry. Okay. I have to admit, that doesn't mean too much to me right now. It's all just sailboats. Okay, what do we do? System, you have 4,125 miles to go. I want to see the message again. Show me the message. Hello, world. Main tree traveler, what? I have no idea what's happening. Oh, no, 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 what am I doing? You do know that you're alone on board, right? Yes, yes, I know that. Um, 
Ah. Swing. No idea what I'm doing. Main sheet. Okay. Am I doing this? What am I doing? I thought this was meant to be a tutorial. Help! Nope, definitely going to stick with the... Um, okay, look. let's have a look at the map. I think there's a lot of boats in this vicinity. They all seem to be stuck where we are. Zooming in on the map. Zooming in. Okay, even better, if I hide the background, that means I can see more. Um, now let's just move this a little bit more that way. What's the sky like? Grey... I can see the moon. Hello, moon. What's over here? We are moving very slowly. I have a feeling our sail is not very tight. Is that good or bad? Do we need to tighten this? I don't know what's, what's this trying to say. Main tree. No. Ooh. Okay. I'm not sure. But we s are we picking up speed? Four knots. No, we're losing speed. Okay, okay, I guess we're going... Against the true wind angle. There we go. Should be picking up some speed now. There we go, we've got the map. Uh, zoom out a little bit again. Although, I do want to actually try and see some land, maybe. Okay, look at that. We can actually see some... I don't know if you can see it on this uh, stream, but you can pick up some uh, angles of how the wind is blowing. Okay, we are... Yep, definitely losing speed. We shall um, go to... What's the port there? Is it going to tell us? Abidjan. Okay. We shall sail straight towards Abidjan. No, no, not, not beyond it. There we go. Okay. What are we doing for speed? 2.8 knots. That's not very fast, is it? 2.9? Oh, oh, we're picking up speed. Speed through water. The perceived speed of the boat. Okay. Two point, uh, we're losing speed. Mauritius, all manual race starts in 10 minutes. Uh, uh... I have a feeling we are not suitable for racing. I wouldn't even know where to race to. All I know right now is that we are... in the middle of the ocean. Heading for land. I definitely need to try and pick up some speed. <laughs> Space in the. So the wind's coming from down here, so technically, like this. No, the. Uh 
here looks even flappier now. Try to make the telltales a little flapping thing. Ah, one. Show an even airflow on both sides. How do I do that? I have no idea. I have absolutely no idea. Okay, what does that mean? Uh, furl or unfurl the Genoa to decrease or increase your sail area. Beware that when you furl the uh, Genoa, the boat may become more eager to steer up against the wind. Weather helm. I have no idea. What are we doing map-wise? We're now heading up that way. Hide the background. Okay, that just puts the background back on. I want to pick up the speed. Absolutely no idea what I'm doing. Lagos might also be quite nice, looking at the map. And apparently there's loads of uh, other sailboats around me and I can't see a single one. I don't know if that's because I'm too far away from them. Maybe I can't see any um, uh, other players at the same time. No idea. But... Uh, I can't actually see anybody out in the ocean. Uh, <laughs> tactical view. Oh, tactical view. Nice. Star signs. Ah. So you can get constellations as well. Okay, so that's uh, show height constellations. It has to be dark with a clear sky. Um, well, it is definitely dark, but not particularly clear. It's quite cloudy. But we shall keep the constellations uh, hidden for now. What does this mean? Let Sailway optimize the sail trim. Uh, yep, Sailway optimize my sail trim for me, please. Show or hide auto navigation tips. Uh, set up, uh, set auto navigation to maintain your heading works online and offline. What is this? Uh, set auto navigation to maintain its angle to the wind. Okay. Set auto navigation to sail the laid out track. I don't even know what the laid out track is. Oh, stop sailing and stay at this position so we can drop our anchor. Um, I mean, it starts to work when you're offline. Oh, I see. So even when you turn off the game, uh, you continue to sail. Interesting. Set auto navigation to maintain uh, angle to the wind. Yeah, but I don't know if I've got the right angle to the wind. I have absolutely no idea. I mean, we are actually picking up speed, so I'm thinking it's it must be doing something better than I than than, than I was. Oh no, it's now the drop speed again. I have no idea. Uh, yes, please optimize stuff. Silver time, the skipper, yes. Indeed I am. Info, uh, right. Trim, okay. Mainsail. Gonna car, mainsail, okay. GPS, map. Right, we are still heading to uh, Abidjan. I feel like we're not actually moving. Is it just me? I mean, we, I, I know we are moving, but on the map it doesn't look like we're moving. How do I set a... Um, instantly go to location. Okay, I am going to location. Uh, 
Can you help me, please? I run aground. How does it... What? Fleet Town. I have... Okay, what? what? Where are we? Show window with your voyage library. I don't even know what my voyage library is. Sail from, name, destination. Okay. Am I... Am I... Uh, I may need to steer away from land. Apparently I am steering into land. Uh, let's close the map quickly. Can I see land anywhere? Land ahoy! Maybe. So, hypothetically speaking, we should be seeing land over there. And, oh, I think I can see some land. I'm gonna head towards land. no idea what land we're seeing right now but um okay so we we are near uh, Abajan. ah okay hold hold on hold on hold on this gives me an idea if i can teleport that way let's teleport to No, we're not going to teleport to Florida. We are going to teleport to East Africa, to Kenya. Maybe to the Malindi coastline in Mombasa. Need some... Have I gone too far south now? I haven't actually... Should have paid attention, Dar es Salaam. Gonna pick up anything here? Come on. Right into GPS details. No. Right. Let's uh, zoom out. Let's zoom out. Okay, so it has some cities in there, Kinshasa. Hmm. What's that? Okay. Which maybe sailing somewhere here might be interesting. so we can... oh, okay. Hold on. Uh, what am I doing? No idea what I'm doing. Okay, let's teleport here. Let's teleport here. Okay. The wind has just picked up. We're in the middle of a storm. It's not some action. I like it. The wind is definitely very strong. The boat is about to tilt. We're um. Well, where are we facing? Give me a map. Uh, head south a little bit towards the Keys. Yep, that's. I mean, the boat is going kind of sideways on the. Um, have we tipped over? No, surely we haven't tipped over. Have we tipped over? Boat? What have we done? We are so tipping over. Come on, Matt. Show me what you got. 
No ma... Okay, so there's definitely other players around, as you can see from the uh, in-game chat. We're uh, going against wind, which is why the uh, sails are flapping like mad. So um, let's see if we can... There we go, this is looking a little bit better. Um, what was this? No, I don't want to maintain the angle. I want you to yeah, optimize sail trim. Let's have a quick look at the map. Yeah, this is looking better. Perfect. Well, we're finally picking up some speed. I think this is the fastest we've been all all evening. Not sure if that's um, something to brag about. Oh, we're slowing down again. Come on, where's the wind? Okay, so that's still uh, optimizing, I think. I have no idea. Swing the uh, boat around this way. The wind's now coming from behind us. There we go. And what's happening? We're picking up some speed. Heading up to 2 knots, 2.2 .2 knots. Big wave, big wave. Nope, not picking up speed. Right, let's uh, head back the other direction. I have absolutely no idea where we're heading with this. But while we're uh, on our course towards uh, the Keys, let's uh, see how this goes. We're picking up some speed. I see we've just been joined by somebody over on YouTube. Hello out to you. Nope, no, nope, camera's over here. Hello. Yes, we have a camera. Um, speed is picking up. Uh, do note the uh, text under the face cam. I am not a sailor. Absolutely not at all. You, you can probably tell just within seconds of watching this. I am not a sailor. I am amazed that we haven't actually sunk this boat yet. Is it possible to sink a boat? Must be. We're definitely able to run her to ground, which we have done, accidentally. So we are getting some speed. I've, I've absolutely no idea if this is good speed, bad speed, 5.3 knots. What's this? SOG. Uh, oh, oh, there was a tooltip. Speed over ground. Oh, hold on. Shouldn't move the mouse, should I? Speed over ground. The speed of the boat has measured against a fixed point. This may differ from the perceived speed of the boat through the water due to a current. Okay. Uh, what's this? The heading. The compass direction at the boat. Both the boat is facing. Okay. The course over ground. The direction which the boat is moving. This may differ from the heading. Ooh, the music sounds dramatic. Is there a pirate boat, maybe? Are we heading into an even bigger storm? Uh, player is saying 
We had a month's rain in one day a few days ago. I don't know if he's talking about in-game or in, in uh, wherever he lives. No idea. But uh, we're up, well, down to, we're definitely losing speed. So the wind must have uh, changed position. True in speed. Okay, the wind, uh, the speed of the wind unaffected by the speed of the boat. Okay. What does that mean? Apparent wind speed, the speed of the wind as you experience it. This differs from the true wind speed because the boat moves, uh, which results in a stronger wind on a non-downwind course. Okay. Okay, so they are talking about Australia. So it must have been... Well, unless it's they're actually in Australia in-game rather than in real life. I have absolutely no idea. Um, okay, so what's our angle? So we are... Maybe, maybe we want to, uh, oh no, 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 not that way. We want to move away from having the winds uh, right behind us. There we go, so we, uh, hold on, we're flapping quite a bit. Oh no, we're, we're getting tighter again. Okay. What are we doing direction-wise? So we're sort of heading a little bit away from the keys right now. Our speed picking up 2.3 2.4 yeah we are getting oh I spoke too soon oh no no there we go there we go and what's this the parent wind angle what is that why does that differ the w angle of the wind as you experience it come on stop hiding the tooltip this differs from the true wind angle because the boat moves which results in the wind coming in from a smaller angle okay that sort of makes sense so the true wind angle was the angle of the winds with uh, with the boats unaffected by the speed of the boats. Okay. 3.2 knots, 3.4 knot speed. The music is sounding quite dramatic now. Like we, I don't know, like something something badass is about to happen or happening. Apparently, um, from what I've seen in the trailer of uh, the game, you can also meet uh, some sea life creatures so you might have some dolphins moving next to you some uh, yeah some some dolphins will be jumping next to your boat swimming alongside your boat I think this might be a good angle our speeds picking up uh, you can definitely see the winds uh, the, the rain lashing out from the side we're riding the waves Speeds now at 5.2 knots, 5.1 knots. We are heading uh, away from the uh, keys though, so let me just adjust that slightly. Should be heading back in slightly. There we go. Means we might lose some of the speed. There we go, yeah, we're dropping down to 4 knots. And we're picking up again. Now we would have. Uh, obviously, the uh, first part of the game was was a little bit heavier on tutorials. Uh, I guess we had a simpler boat to uh, to use, um, but uh, when it moved us over into this tutorial, it would have been or into, into this boat it would have been quite nice to actually have uh, a little bit more tutorial to actually kind of tell us what we have to do with this boat because I have I, I still have no idea. No idea in the slightest. Mm. Dramatic music has stopped as well now. Hold on. Okay, so the wind is blowing from over there. That's a big wave. That's a big wave. So if I move... Technically, it should be... Move this way. Does that mean? Let's have a look at our uh, flag. Is it flapping? It is flapping. And our boat's sort of a little bit sideways. Not not as sideways as it was as it was when we um, t 
teleported our way into uh, when we teleported our way into uh, the Florida region. And hello, Sovi. Uh, yes, with the face cam. First time. Hello out to you. Figured a spontaneous uh, sailing stream requires some uh, spontaneous additions. Uh, oh. I feel like we're going a bit too slow. No, and I feel like we should head this way. I felt like we had more speed going this way. kind of uh, yes this game is rough Sobi <laughs> it's interesting but it's, it's, it's definitely rough um, quite steep learning curve I, I, I don't know if I somehow skipped a tutorial or kind of cancelled uh, the tutorial that was meant to happen here no idea but it is uh Yes, not not the easiest to learn. It is early access, um, needs to be said. So the, the the full version may very well be different. But um, oh wait, our speed's picking up. Three point six. No idea which way we're heading right now. See on the map. I mean, we've we've been kind of on this course now for I don't know what 10, 10 minutes, fifteen minutes, and it looks like we haven't actually um, gone anywhere. I mean, we're, we're kind of going parallel the keys. Uh, the purpose of the game, um, it, it, yeah, I, I guess just to kind of yeah, sail successfully, pretty much, yeah. It's um, a sailing simulator. I've never sailed it before in my life. Um, figured if I was to s get onto a real-life sailboat with me at the helm, um, it would end badly. So, uh, doing it in a digital sailing simulator is, is probably the safest uh, I will ever be on a sailboat. The music makes me, um, I don't know, think of pirates though. Like, I'm, I, I need to mount my cannons and fire it at, at something. Raid the mainland. Sorry, even the not sailor needs to drink every now and then. So yeah, let's zoom out a little bit again. So we've got some boats closer to the shoreline. Um, I'll see if I can steer my way in. Maybe if I get uh, a tailwind angle of... There we go. That's, that's taking us quite steep in, isn't it? And the tailwind speed's still around 22. Or a true wind speed even, not tailwind speed. Uh, question is, does that increase our speed here, or let's have a look at our flags. Our flags are saying the wind's coming from over here. Speed is, well, kind of, I mean, whoa! I mean, it is absolutely lashing it down with rain. In-game rain, of course. I feel like we're not actually moving anywhere. Three knots. Three knots seems really slow. Correct me if I'm wrong. If, if three knots is incredibly fast, then please tell me. But I would imagine it is really slow. And here's the dramatic music again.
Is there another uh, sailboat around? While this uh, is sailing onwards, because I think it still continues to sail while we um, are in the menu. Let's uh, go into the edit boat appearance. Boat name. My boat is called uh, the Sorbitar. And. Uh, Nope, we will. Sh we shall call it. Yeah. That um. Actually, you know what? I'll put it out to you. Um. Give me a name. <laughs> Do you mean it should be uh, daytime in in? In real time or daytime in game? Round. Mm. Cyber. Well, that looks. I like the color scheme. The name should be Mr. Beaumont, okay. Mr. Beaumont it is. If I can type. Let's try that one again. Mr. Beaumont. No! Okay, let's take the... There we go. We shall do it round. Mr. Beaumont. Uh, antique? No, antique. What does medium do? Bold? Nah, bold doesn't... Bold looks like it's just kind of plastered on. Oh, a rune. Hmm, okay, we've got some more... Writing. I think writing looks quite good. Fast writing. The cheesy friends reference, I see. So is your friend more of a slow writer or a fast writer? Or an elegant writer? Let's have a quick look at the map. No, no, we're still doing good. Hello, Denology. Thanks for joining. Well, as long as I can get away from the Huntress as well as Dwight, it, I'm I'm good with that. Uh, for those that obviously are not on Twitch right now, um, a fellow YouTuber who you may uh, know if you've been watching the Dead by Daylight series, um, Denology has uh, just joined the stream and suggested that uh, Brock was right, I do look like Dwight. <laughs> so we're going to leave it with Mr. Beaumont and I think we're going to stick to the elegant writing. Now the flag... Uh, where's our home port? Your, our home port is going to be... Um, what is our home port? Our home port is going to be YouTube. Yeah. Our hull above waterline. Yep. No, 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 no. Clear. No. Underwater. But does it matter what the boat looks like underwater? Boat name. No, uh, okay. I can I can deal with that. Deal with that. Let's resume. Uh, okay. 
How do I get out of this? I want to get out of this. Oh, there we go. Lovely. Now, unfortunately, I can't actually see the um, boat name myself, but I guess that kind of makes sense because you, I, I guess, wouldn't really want to uh, be outside of the boat while you're uh, in the middle of the ocean. So, how are, I, have we actually moved? Have we moved? I feel that our 2.9 knots or 3.1 knots now are incredibly slow. Three point four knots. Doesn't. So what? What? what what's was with this uh, dramatic music? What is with this dramatic music? Let's uh, hide the background here. Um. No, it is a, a new game, so we, uh, technology. It is a uh, uh, just came out in early access, and uh, I was uh, sent the key for it earlier today, um, and I figured I would give it a whirl, see what uh, see what the sailing simulator is all about, and see if I can improve my uh, sailing skills. The initial thought is that I definitely haven't improved my sailing skill. I would probably still die a horrible death out in the sailboat. And yes, so we should definitely get a, uh, a PC upgrade. Would be good to have you uh, join the Dead by Daylight crew. The music does make it feel intense. <laughs> although I feel like I'm just literally sitting in water somewhere, although I'm I'm I guess tailwind is what did the initial tutorial say? If it's zero you don't really move. Same if it's from the front or from the back, uh, yeah. Something like that. I do have uh, Gmod as well. Never really played it too much though. So we've uh, just moved location. Can we see anything else here? No, nothing. Steering is a little bit more tricky. So that looks like a big wave. Just catching up in the uh, chat. <laughs> so I have a feeling. Oh, and um, yes, if you. It, it seems like that if you log off the game, it will continue on your course and uh, continue sailing for you offline, which makes me think that actually it might be a case of uh, the... sailing literally taking a lot longer. Uh, maybe uh, real time rather than um, uh, sped up for, for in-game activity. Oh, there's Jacksonville. No, I don't want to teleport into Jacksonville. It, would, it, it might be funny if I did teleport into Jacksonville, but... Um, oh, okay, so... Uh, no, oh, no, no, we don't see the names anymore. We just saw... There we go, there we go. It's been years since I've been down to the Keys. And... 
No, nope, can't see any more names now. I'd imagine that might be something that will come... Uh, the map is quite big. The map is quite literally... Uh, let me scroll out for you. The map is quite literally the world. And it does look like we're just on the cusp of... Uh, daytime to nighttime, or evening. Uh, the sun going down. So I'm pretty sure that if we were to teleport over here somewhere, it would be daytime. It, it might not be, but uh, I would imagine it might be. We might uh, put it down to Chile. You know what? Why don't we teleport to Australia? They seem to have... Uh, uh, yep, you can travel the entire map. And it will probably take you... Take you a very long time. Um, now, if I knew where the Bermuda Triangle was, like as in the actual GPS uh, coordinates and locations and whatnot, I would teleport myself there. It looks like it's pretty windy over here. Let's teleport over here. Maybe we'll have. Yep, teleport. Go on, chop chop. Ah, daytime. I'm sure the idea is not necessarily that you teleport everywhere, but uh, for the sake of trying out the game and I guess having a bit of a test of it. Yeah, map knowledge is not great for me as well, especially maritime uh, map knowledge is lackluster at best. Now, let's see, okay, so the speed actually seems to be even mellower over here than, um, than we thought. Based on the animations earlier, it looked like it was meant to be incredibly windy. There's wind coming from over there. Okay, I think we need to turn the boat around. Let's go up here. Move to this position. I'm the king of the world! Something like that. What was that reference from Titanic? <laughs> Being up here is going to make me sick, though. So. Let's head back over here. Can we go into the cabin? Let's see if we can go in. Ah, uh, no, it doesn't look like the cabin. But can we... Let's go here. Oh, no, that... Oh, no, 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 we can't go in the cabin. Thought we could go in. That would have been quite sweet. There we go, we're... <laughs> Drawing like one of your French girls. <laughs> I'm not sure I want to see Dwight like that. Let's see if we can... Uh... Pick up some speed. So, Don, when are we uh, launching our next Dead by Daylight session? Generally, usually free around this time. Uh, yeah, I think I've got two. I think I've got two more episodes. So I, I think I recorded one more, one longer than than uh, you did anyway. I'm not sure if, if uh, Brock recorded another one as well. Um, but yeah, you obviously lost your uh, Huntress one, unfortunately. Why am I not picking up any speed?
Oh, you've, you've, you've got one where you're a killer. I hope anybody watching this isn't going to take this out of context. <laughs> Uh, 1.5 knots does not feel fast. Anybody reading the Twitch chat? Uh, Denology is not talking about um, going on a murderous rampage and recording himself. He is actually talking about a game. Which, I mean, okay, the, the wind over here seems to be generally very low. According to the true wind speeds, uh, we've only got four knots uh, and we're picking up 1.2 knots. Okay, so that is, I guess, vaguely uh, expectable that we're not going to go very fast. So. I have a feeling, uh, um, let's see, where would our angle take us? So at the speed that we're going right now, in about three and a half years, we would be crashing into uh, Seoul, or maybe uh, maybe Tokyo, if the wind, uh, if, if the waves carry us a little bit. So. Um, might just adjust that slightly, uh, just to make sure that we are heading towards Japan. Yes, there we go. See what our friends over there are up to. At a staggering 0.7 knots. Very impressive. And I think we will uh, leave it here for now and maybe jump into another game shortly. Um, I will uh, stop the stream before we move on to another game though. Um, just to kind of keep the uh, session separate and um, Maybe we'll swing by uh, again later on uh, in the week um, for another quick uh, stream of uh, Sailway, uh, the sailing simulator. Uh, we've been sailing now for just roughly an hour, I think. Um, so, but I think I need something that's uh, got a little bit more pace to it. Um, not saying that. Um, uh, it's a bad game, uh, not not in the slightest. Um, but I think I, for myself, need to read up on it a little bit more. Um, and uh, figure out what um, what everything does. Maybe, I don't know, buy myself a little sailing book. Um, so for now... Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. I've, the Nology just, uh, uh, for those that are on the Twitch chat, uh, the Nology just reminded me that I can, of course, change the game um, from, well, still while being in the stream. Uh, so I'm just going to uh, close this down quickly. <laughs> 